Already, 2015 is an important year in the life of our university. It is in this year that we, as a community, will focus in earnest on several critical issues. Issues like access, affordability, and the student experience. This year is also the year I would like to fulfill our commitment to lead the national fight against sexual violence and harassment on campus. As a part of these efforts, I am today accepting all 18 recommendations made to me by the University-wide Task Force on Sexual Assault and Sexual Harassment, a group that was charged with reviewing and providing an evaluation of Penn State's activities related to sexual assault and other forms of sexual or gender-based harassment. I'd like to thank the Task Force, a group of 17 knowledgeable and committed individuals for their insight, dedication, and vision in developing recommendations to create a campus environment where violence and harassment of any kind is not tolerated. While Penn State has had many successes in addressing these deeply troubling issues, we can always do more. We must do more. I would like to invite all faculty, staff, and students, as well as community members, to read the task force report, which can be found online. Sexual assault and sexual harassment are vastly underreported and have no place in our community. As a member of our community, I'm asking you to take on the weighty responsibility of educating others, reporting issues, preventing harm, and fostering a culture that prioritizes consent and respect. By accepting this report and its recommendations, I'm setting our community on a path to create an environment in which sexual misconduct is unacceptable, reporting is encouraged, and survivors are supported to the fullest. It is my deepest hope that we can put a stop to sexual misconduct and violence and sexual harassment on all of our campuses. I hope you will join me.